up India's second biggest state-run bank, the Punjab National Bank, has said today that it has detected a 1.7 billion fraud at a single branch in the nation's financial hub of Mumbai, the impact of which could extend to other lenders as well. The bank is in an exchange filing on Wednesday said that it has detected some fraudulent and unauthorized transactions in one of its branches for the benefit of a few select account holders with their uh, apparent connivance, it said in that exchange filing on Wednesday. The case poses further questions about the health of India's banks, which are already grappling with one of the worst bad loan uh, ratios among the big economies. Onitam, my colleague, has more. Uh, the uh, bank informing the Bombay Stock Exchange today that there has been fraudulent transactions and on the basis of these transactions, in fact, banks overseas appear to have lent money to these select customers. So as far as the uh, finance ministry official reaction is concerned, what uh, sources have told us off record, of course, is that um, they, um, as many as 10 employees uh, are, uh, have been suspended so far and the action uh, has been handed over. In fact, the uh, Central Bureau of Investigation is now looking into the matter. In fact, just a week uh, earlier, the CBI had announced that it has um, initiated investigations uh, against uh, Nirav Modi, a, a well-known designer, ju jewelry designer. So he is supposed to be involved in this uh, case. However, the uh, Punjab National Bank has not mentioned any individual in its uh, re, uh, in its uh, announcement to the uh, stock exchange. The investigation, the internal investigation of the bank uh, was initiated long back. It is uh, once that their uh, vigilance uh, committee, the team that was looking into the matter, had uh, found uh, that there were fraudul fraudulent transactions and some of its own employees were involved. Uh, and this happened in one of the branches of Punjab National Bank in Mumbai. After that, it went ahead and informed the stock exchange. Uh, and now the CBI has taken over the case. We are, in fact, awaiting few more state statements from the uh, Banking Division of Finance Ministry as well as the Punjab National Bank itself.